Okay, so right here we have the link timeline and edit selection button and currently it is enabled so here's what the behavior looks like when it's enabled let's take this grabber tool and I'm just gonna select a region okay you see that the region is highlighted but if you look above it you you'll see that this uh, area of the timeline is highlighted as well and wherever I click Whatever I highlight down here, it gets highlighted up here. And if I hit the space bar, it'll start playing. Dear Santa, I've been on my best behavior. I brush before bedtime, I play nice with the neighbors. Start playing wherever my selection, uh, wherever my edit selection begins. I took out the trash when it is my turn to. Oh, I got a real Okay, so that's what the behavior is like if it is enabled if link timeline and edit selection is not enabled okay so you see that these two are currently selected um, the region selected and the area of the timeline is selected as well uh, if I click over here notice that the timeline selection doesn't change the uh, the edit selection does but the timeline selection stays the same so what happens if I click, if I uh, press the space bar? Well, if I press the space bar, Ooh, I got a real good feeling. you'll see that the playback begins from where the beginning of the timeline selection is, not from where the edit selection begins. And if I want to play the edit selection, I have to press the open bracket key. Dear Santa, I've been on my best behavior. I brush before bedtime, I play nice with the neighbor. So the space bar will play the timeline selection. The open bracket key will play, play the edit selection. Dear Santa, I've been and the close bra bracket key Ooh, I got a real good It's just another way of playing the timeline selection. So if we link these again, watch what happens we're back in business and this this can be good if you are editing and you don't want to lose your timeline selection so let's say I, it took me five minutes to figure out this particular selection right here so uh, but I need to edit this part over here so I unlink the timeline and edit selection and then I can go in and do whatever I need to over here whatever I need to do over there over here and I never lose my timeline selection. And if I hit spacebar, starts right where the timeline selection begins. The only way I'll lose it is if I click in the actual uh, timeline up here. So there you go. That's link, timeline, and edit selection.